एथिक्स इन यू एस एम एल स्टेप वन हैज़ नाउ बिकम द न्यू हाई ईल्ड आई रिसेंटली टुक यू एस एम एल स्टेप वन एंड आई फेल्ट लाइक देर वर्ड लाइक एट टू टू वन एथिक्स क्वेश्चन पर ब्लॉग एंड इफ यू काउंट इट अप वी आर टॉकिंग अबाउट लाइक फिफ्टी फाइव टू सेवेंटी क्वेश्चन इन अ टू एटी क्वेश्चन एग्जाम एंड दैट इज ह्यूज इफ यू लुक एट द यू एस एम एल ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी थ्री रिजल्ट रिपोर्ट इट शोज द वेटेज ऑफ एथिक्स फ्रॉम एट टू थर्टीन परसेंट बट इफ यू कंपेयर इट टू यू एस एम एल ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी फोर रिजल्ट रिपोर्ट इट शोज द वेटेज ऑफ टेन टू फिफ्टीन परसेंट सो अपेंटली देर इज जस्ट टू परसेंट इंक्रीज बट इन रियलिटी द डिफरेंस is a bit more as i have talked to a lot of people who recently took usml step 1 and step 2 and everyone is saying that ethics is now making the major portion of the exam some students reported that the ethics is now making 20 to 30% of the exam so ethics can make or break your usml step 1 and here is the problem ethics questions are tricky they are not like your regular memorization and recall questions they require your deeper understanding of ethical principles and their application in real clinical scenarios i feel like your world is not sufficient enough to prepare you well for the ethics of usml step 1 and don't get me wrong you are still the gold standard for usml step 1 preparation but its section of ethics is a bit limited although it have like 140 questions but you need to supplement it with another resource also when you are very close to your exam you are focusing heavily on nbmes so nbmes does not prepare you well for the ethics of usml step 1 although they have some ethics question but they are not the actual depiction of the real exam that you are going to see on your exam day so how to master ethics and boost your score the best strategy is that you start preparing for ethics from you world by doing only 10 to 15 questions daily and don't attempt the whole 40 block questions and get done with in 3 to 4 days when you do ethics questions over a longer period of time like 2 to 3 weeks by doing only 10 to 15 questions this way you slowly and steadily build your mindset and your approach towards reading ethical questions and coming to the answer also when you are like one or two weeks out from your exam just dedicate one day to ethics and do 3 to 4 blocks of ethics from emboss in one day when you are going to attempt 120 to 130 questions from emboss in a single day just one or two weeks out from the exam you will simulate uh, the exam day because on the exam day you are going to attempt again 60 to 70 ethical questions and uh, doing those questions just one or two weeks out solidifies all the information that you require on the exam day and that approach you have built slowly over a longer period of time also gets refreshed just before the exam in this way you will be prepared best for the ethical questions that are tricky to pick and you are always confused between two options that seems right to you if you haven't started preparing for ethics for your upcoming usml step 1 exam then now is the time because ethics is the new high yield now and i guess that's pretty much it for this video hope you got something out of it and learned something new i will make more content on usml in my upcoming videos until then if you have any questions or you want me to make a video on a certain topic just comment down below on this video and i will do it thank you for watching this video and good luck for your usml journey and good luck to me as well